because it's clay, it expands. So when you when it arrives, what we always recommend, it settles in the bucket. So we recommend giving it a dry whisk first because it's got pigment in it as well, you know. So give it a good dry whisk, mix it all up again a bit. Then put your water in the bucket, same as you would a water finish. Um, add powder to it, whisk it up. But then when you've whisked it up on your first one, until you've got it sort of fairly pliable and usable, just let it stand for 10 minutes. Um, if you want to feel it, it's, it's got quite a lot of fat in it. It's quite fatty, it's quite, it's quite nice. Because the first bit, your first coat that you put on, really you want to keep it thin. You, know? you don't want to be too thick because, because there's no chemical set. You want to get your first coat on and let it start pulling back. You know what I mean? If you put it on thick, 5 mil, which is when I'm showing gypsum plasters, that's what, that's what they do. Then because it's so thick, it takes longer to go. They get bored with waiting because there's no chemical set. So then they start trying to trail it up before it's ready. And then they just bring the water up with the steel. So if you're going on to board, ideally, first one nice and thin. And uh, feel free to jump in if you want to do that. Um, and then all you're going to do then is go over it again with the second coat. See, that's pulled back now, that's dry. Yeah. Yeah. So, so, so. See it? So now what you're doing is you left a bit long, is it? I'll tell you what, it's a good one. Come on, yeah. I'm going to be doing one.